Praise the Lord, family, and greetings from Disciple Ministries, located in Radcliffe, Kentucky. We pray you receive this message in good health and in perfect peace. As I prepared to give this week's food from a raven, I had my text and was somewhat ready to deliver. But as usual, I'm prayerful prior to recording, and I believe I heard the Lord give me the travail which is a long ways <laughs> from where I was going. And I haven't the time to study it out before delivery. Therefore, I'm going to open my mouth and give us what I believe he has given me. Galatians, the fourth chapter in the 19th verse of the King James Version reads, My little children, of whom I travail in birth again until Christ be formed in you. The word travail is noted as labor in the New King James Version. and goes on to say suffering birth pains in the Amplified Version. I served as a set man for over three years and have experienced countless emotions, attacks, and the pains of ministry. I now better understand this particular text as uh, I'm recalling sharing with a friend several months ago that the best way I could describe what I was going through is to say that I feel as though I'm in labor, travailing, <laughs> but I never took the time to take it to the scripture. What I believe God is telling us today is that as leaders, regardless of where we are in ministry, whether it's the mega or the lesser, we must embrace a lifestyle instead of a season of travail on behalf of God's people. A seasonal travail will allow people to become or remain lost in the in-between or the off-season. But a lifestyle of travail will show us how to truly intercede and to show forth the love of the Father that's working in us. To remind us that Jesus is the example for us, the master builders, placing someone else before ourselves. <laughs> now, 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 now. For the lay member, the Christian, the backslider, and the unsaved. God wants us to know that people are painfully crying out, travailing over, and labor for a suffering birth pains on your behalf until Christ be formed in you. For those that would say that this doesn't apply to me, notice that Paul says, I travail in birth again. In essence, <laughs> in essence, we may not be what we think we are in Christ. We may not be full of the Holy Ghost. We may not be the righteousness of God or as holy as we think we are. But glory be to God that there's someone travailing until Christ be formed in us. Let's attempt to relieve the pain by allowing God to be fully formed in us all. The travail. Apostle Chauncey Craig at Discipling Ministries, where we're not concerned about a building, but the building of a people. I love you and praying for you.